The owner of a new kind of coffee house is connecting with the Charlotte community through all five senses. Their sensory inspired business is also employing people who are often overlooked in the workforce. Queen City News reporter Brett Baldeck is taking us on a tour inside this unique coffee house and sharing the inspiration behind the brand. Good morning, Brett. Good morning, NY and Jason. So the first inspiration for the Harvest Coffee Roasting Company came back in 1998. And now fast forward to today, and the owner has been operating his business in Charlotte for more than a year now. A walk inside could give someone a sensory overload, and the owner says that's exactly the goal. If you follow your nose, you'll smell the scent of fresh roasted coffee in West Charlotte. Harvest coffee workers don't just roast coffee here. The employees package it and even sell it at a connected coffee house. And so what we've done is create a coffee experience and it is one of a kind in the world. The experience starts in the coffee lab. It's where someone can literally experience different notes of coffee similar to a wine tasting. And each person walking through is going to have their own experience unique to themselves, identifying a coffee type of application and a flavor. Each flavor of coffee is associated with different colors. With the press of a button, the coffee lab will change those colors. You can even sense the taste of coffee by touch. The goal is to use all five senses. It's to help customers choose their favorite cup of Joe. But you could say there is an even more important reason why senses here shine. Each one of our employees has a different way in which they're coming to the business because they have intellectual and developmental disabilities. People with Down syndrome, autism, and other disabilities do it all from roasting beans to printing labels onto bags. Because typically um, individuals that are in that position are in the background and we don't want to do that. We want to be in the forefront. Creator Toby Foreman has always put people first, starting with his own family. His brother has autism and his son Reed has Down syndrome. Reed's first job opportunity came here. And to see my son thriving is all the joy in the world for me. So we have uh, some of the bags of coffee here and each bag uh, has its own story. So we'll start with the bag. Each one has a sensory sleeve, they call it, and it has its own artwork on the front. I'm gonna hold it up just a little bit because it's a super, th oh, there we go. Uh, so that each one has its own artwork and uh, those with intellectual disabilities also create the artwork based on how people describe each flavor of coffee. Um, and then also, I'm gonna move this bag really quick. Uh, you'll notice that oh, there, you'll notice their logo is three C's, and the C's stand for uh, capable, competent, and compassion. And then it's really, really hard to see, but there's three little lines at the bottom of the logo, and that is for the 21st chromosome, which uh, is the one that uh, I guess uh, causes or is the uh, chromosome that is Down syndrome. So, and then finally, this, there's so much to talk about with this bag, it's amazing. So finally, if you look at the bottom of each bag, there will be a name on it, and that is uh, the person who packed it. And I was I looking this that. morning, and this one says Reed. So ah. his son packed this bag of coffee for us. Um, just a really inspirational story. Uh, like I said, coolest bag of coffee with a story that you could ever think of. And just mm -hmm. going there and, and seeing all of them work uh, was just amazing. And they get paychecks. It's not volunteering. They're physically working and yeah. getting paychecks. And like he said, uh, it's, you know, people are often left behind and not offered jobs. So he's giving them an opportunity to work and earn money. And uh, just when I was there, they're happy to be there and they love what they're doing, yeah. which is the best part. There's a part. lot of love that goes into yes. that, that cup of coffee. And 